Oh, no wonder why I'm going through all that, uh... You can see the potential? Oh, well, thank you. I'll take it. Alright, where'd all them boars go? Fox. Woods, roots and trunks. Yeah, y'all ain't getting away from me. I want your meats. I want Trisha. your fatty meats. Oh, hey, one more and we got it. Got it, chat. We got... We got what we looking for. Oh, my God. Can I move... Is Can I move this? Can I make that faster, please? Uh, controls... Uh, do we need an announcer for uh <laughs> our guy? Oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey. Anyways, um aim assist mountain sprint. Uh well, that's control mapping. Really? Oh well fine, whatever. I'll just I guess that's the quick way to do it. Boop. <sighs> Once I get this golden uh, thing, hey, I can actually I can sell my travel slow. That'll be great. Huh? What? Oh, you're right here. This item provides unlimited fast travel to discover campfires and settlements throughout the world. Hooray for unlimited fast travel. I know, right? I only have 18 own le left. Ooh. Oh, that's like 50 shards. Okay, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to buy those anymore. Speaking of selling now. <laughs> okay, um... Just sell them, I don't care about them. Get them out of here! Do-do-do-do-do. Also, this guy sells the Shadow War Bow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Are you working on a cartoon, are you? I definitely need a new Shadow Bow. A uh, War Bow. So. Though, then again, I don't really use it. Uh, books first, then an ARG. Ha, okay. Anyways, um, I think that's about it. All we can do. If I don't get my goods to buyers soon, they'll cancel the contract. So. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, that's fat. Oh, the, oh. I no longer have to worry about 
other stuff. Feels so great. All right, chat. We're doing it. We're finally going to Meridian. Don't look to me for help. My duty is to guard. I don't get involved in politics. Uh, What's uh, going on here? Roland's in there somewhere. And so is Erend, that other outlander I talked to the night before the proving. Erend said he'd introduce me to his sister if I visited Meridian. Said she was captain of the vanguard. But if I remember correctly, they were just talking about something that happened to her. It's always the merchants who suffer. If Ursa. Up, or something like, or something like that. We all have our place about getting through, outlander. Which, uh, is not good. Stop right there. In light of the recent attack, no stranger passes into Meridian without submitting to search. Recent attack? What are you talking about? The murder of Captain Ursa and her vanguards, of course. Ambushed by Shadow Karja forces in Redridge Pass. Ursa? You mean Erend's sister is dead? How would you know his name? I know Erend. Summon him. I need to speak to him. Ha. Huh. I doubt that Aaron, the new captain of the Vanguard, a man in grief, is going to waste his time on a grimy outlander. Aloy, hey, you're alive. I thought you were dead. Make way, make way. All the way to Meridian just to see me. Have you been drinking? <laughs> ah, not really. A little. So you're alive. This, uh, we should celebrate. It drinks on me. We need to talk alone, and you need to pull it together. Over there. So you approve? Of course I approve. From now on, she may come and go from this city as she pleases. As you wish, sir. There. Alone as you asked. And what did you want to tell me? Your sister. I heard what happened to Ursa. I'm sorry. I know she was special to you. Special to me? Special to everyone. She always knew what to do. She bossed everyone around. She kept me in line. And now I'm supposed to fill her shoes. And instead, here I am, stumbling around in them. Yeah. Stop feeling sorry for yourself. <laughs> Oh, that is rude. You don't tell a grieving man that. No, they will punch your lights out. Excuse me, what'd you tell me? Clock. Yeah, no, thank you. Um, I lost someone too. I, uh, I lost someone too. At the proving, the man who raised me. His name was Rost. That's terrible. Why is it every time something terrible happens? Everyone else tells you the worst thing that ever happened to them, so that makes it easier. Be nice to Aaron, he's a good egg, yeah. he is. Why is that? Anyway, there was something you wanted to tell me? Oh, well, why I'm here. A lot has happened since we last spoke. The Proving was attacked by a group of killers. Not many of us survived. We were in the village when we heard explosions up on the mountain. Some of your braves came back. Said most of the contestants were dead. I've never heard such a wail of grief as the sound that rose up from your people. How did you survive? How I survived is less important than how I was targeted. Targeted? What do you mean? The killers came for me because of Olin. What are you talking about? That doesn't make sense. I need to find Olin. I need to know what he knows. But he's a friend. No, he's a traitor. I don't know who the killers are or what they want, but I do know that Olin is working with them. But, I mean, this... I don't need you to understand, Erend. I just need you to take me to him. He's not here. He went scrounging for scrap and relics days ago. It could be anywhere. Are there any places he frequents, places he returns to? A house. Here in Meridian. Okay, then take me there. I need to search it. I guess. As long as I'm there to witness the search. 
Time to go to Olin's. I need to see Olin's place. Now. And buddy. Okay, I... okay. Come on. Aaron, I not to be rude, but you do kinda need to sober up here. <laughs> Get this man some wake up juice. So many people here all talking at once. How does anyone think? I don't. I just drink. Walking warrant. <laughs> Is she a moral? Apparently they're letting anyone into the city these days. That must be the spire. How long it's huge. Can blood hide in his palace to lay siege to the citadel? Blood for blood. Vengeance for Ursa. How long will Avad hide in his palace? Year after year, why does he spare those who enslaved and tortured and butchered? Errant, you should want vengeance more than anyone. Your own sister, murdered, and her death, unavenged? One more word, you scorched out slag, and I'll throw you in jail myself. Now get out of here! Or I'll give you all a kick in the ass. Damn. What he mean about Ursus murder? Not now. I'm sure it's a lie, but with so many dying recently. Hope you're well. Ugh, errand, buddy. Okay, how are we gonna get in? <clears throat> oh, that was subtle. I mean, that's are. how you do it. Try not to break anything. That, other than the door. All of this for one man. It pays to have connections in the Sun King's court. Let's see what's underneath. Hey, how did that get here? Question is, how to get through it? Without a key, you won't. That's a vault hatch of Azaram make. Nothing gets through. We'll see about that. I don't think you're getting through that hatch. Uh, what happened? To the, uh, what happened outside? Are you sure you're okay? I'm sober enough. All right, I don't need another lecture. That's not what I meant. I was talking about what happened outside with the crowd. I don't want to talk about that. We're here because of what you said about Olin, so do what you need to do. Have you been here before? Did Olin ever invite you in? Nah. Closest I got was a doorstep to help him home after a night out. We drank a river that night, but I hold it well. Y usually. <laughs> Olin and the Sun King. You said King. Olin has connections in the royal court. Does he know the Sun King personally? No. He served the court as a scout sometimes and sold ancient trinkets to nobles, but he never had an audience with the king. If you're right and Olin's into something dark, Sun King Avad has nothing to do with it. I'd stake my life on that. All right. I'll and look around. around. That's what we came for. Call it a day, girl. You're wasting time. Uh, Bunik Pilgrim. A lot of metal here. Could be just what I need. big and heavy could do a lot of damage if it fell down let's give it a little push oh this is gonna end well
I did say not to break anything, didn't I? <laughs> Ow. Worth it. Don't break anything except doors. Yeah, a door each is fair. <laughs> child captive they who's they the killers they told him to obey or they'd kill his family well that's a bit unfortunate looks like Olin kept a journal Olin I knew he could read contracts but I never took him for a poet no doubt now Olin knew I was targeted I am a traitor now and see no way out. I start at the beginning how, uh, how they turned me. Perhaps I can see something I missed. No, there is no escape. What good can writing do? Uh, uh, writing, writing it do. That's the fourth day. Tenth day. You gave me this folio when you taught me to write all these years later. Uh, oh. Later, it still smells of you, lavender and ash of the forge. All I have left of you. Uh, write me notes. You said when you gave it. Uh, share your thoughts. Uh, tear the leads, said the pages, to show I'm thinking of you, but I never did. Hands too grubby to touch parchment. How oh, I wish I'd done as you said. Dream your hair in the forge light. Our sons wait on shoulders. Fourth day every week, the evidence calls me in secret. When the device calls me in secret to a new dig site. We work like men with whips to our backs as though it was left to us. Oh, it was left to us to upturn the soil of the entire earth. Okay, so they're forcing them to dig up uh, metal world areas. Uh, I drink with Aaron and Ursa, but not even the sweetest brew can wash the taste of guilt from my mouth. Every day my sons betrays them. The villains watch through the fight. I keep expecting Ursa to stick a blade through my throat, but fire and spit... Uh, she does not suspect me. Better liar than I thought myself. Huh. Okay. A 54th day. Oh. Pitchful sleep. Um. A th past three nights thinking on that Nora girl. Why did it order her killed? The device must be. Even so, what threat could she pose? We heard explosions and distant screams from the village. I thought the savages might blame us or aren't turn on us. I almost wished for it. But their matrix ordered us gone. We fled to the border with an escort of braves, crossed that day tower. Now I am called to a dig, uh, to a dig in the rock wreath. They promise another glimpse of you, of our son. map. The glyphs show places he visited. Okay. There's your proof. Read the last page. He writes about meeting me and the order to kill me. He called himself a friend. That backstabbing cheat. How did you learn to read glyphs? And these things that you see, how do you do it? I see things with the focus. The focus. It reveals the unseen. And Olin's focus. It's the same? The device is the same, but somehow Olin and the killers can speak to each other with their focuses over distances and see through each other's focuses too, <coughs> like looking through each other's eyes. So that's how the killers saw you? Through Olin? Yes, so far as I can tell. Well, I should be going. Now that I know where to find Olin, I should be on my way. 
All by yourself? Leave it to me. I'm faster on my own. Wait. If that device lets you see the unseen... Out of the way, Erend. I'm asking you to help me, Aloy. I need to know who killed Ursa. Not just the, the Shadow Karja army, I know that, but the exact soldiers who did it. I'm sorry about your sister, but that's your war, not mine. Don't act like this isn't personal. You came here hunting the people who nearly killed you, who massacred your people. Why should you have justice and not me? Look, I'll head for Redridge Pass, where Ursa's body was found, and wait for you there. A few minutes of your focus is all I need. Don't make me beg. Redridge Pass, you said? I'll see what I can do. Damn. And we got four more quests incoming. And this is the... Okay, so... We got a lot to do, chat. We got a lot to do. Uh, where's this one taking me? Good God. <laughs> okay. New adventures <laughs> New adventures await. <laughs> Here we go. Anyways, uh, main. The field of the fallen. I think we'll do that one. Where's that one lead me? Oh, about the same distance. <laughs> oh, I think it's even longer. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, even longer. It's even further away. Oh. What's, uh. Let's deal with the Hunter's Lodge first. Actually, you know what? Let's let's gather all these quests and see what they say. This place. Couldn't imagine living. Special modification box. I'll take that one. A random weapon or outfit modification. I'll take that one. A box holding an unreliable assortment of items. Unreliable. <laughs> oh, free. Wait, no, they're not free. Those were not free. Anyways. It smells like nothing I've ever smelled before. Is that some Arrested kind of spice? Arrested two for disorderly conduct last night. Okay. Um. Okay. Dude. Dude. Cute. Thank you. 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 Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. What's in you? What the hell was that? Oh. Oh, that's all that was? Just a special, oh, okay. Used for trading with merchants. Wait, what? I can trade this with merchants? What? You don't want to know what they
No? Game just lied to me. Yep, game just lied to me. Specialized merchants for extremely powerful weapons and armor. No value except to the most electric of uh, merchants. Okay. You're not who I'm looking for. You, maybe. You're looking for artifacts. Yes, but I'm no profiteer. Sun King Avad has named me an envoy to the Banuk. I work on their behalf, looking for sacred relics to return to their homeland, Ben-Ur. I'm especially interested in wooden figures that are sometimes found near Banuk rock paintings. If you have any, I have valuables to trade for them. More about you. You said the king named you an envoy to the Banuk? Yes. I've been to Ben-Ur many times, and the Wirek chiefs trust me. I help them maintain diplomatic ties with Avad. Some say they're a mysterious people, but their ways make a lot of sense to me. All you have to do is be the best. Doesn't matter if you're born high or low, man or woman. They respect skill, not some fool notion of heritage. I see the appeal. I wish more Karja did. Anything they don't understand, they call backward or savage. Uh, Tell figures. me more about these Banuk figures. We have a couple. Simple wood sculptures made by Arnak, a legendary hunter who was exiled from Ban-Ur for killing his chief. He left the figures near painted stones in places that reminded him of his homeland. Later, his tribe declared him oh, innocent. excuse me. Now they see him as a kind of wandering hero and want those figures back. I do what I can to help him get them, including trade for them. If you have any. Uh, trade? You ready? Let's trade then. Uh, map, vent, and explorer's map adds map markers hinting at the locations of Vantage. Got him. Oh, each of them has a name? Huh. Come on back if you find any Banuke goods. Found any Banuke relics in the wilds, Outlander? Oh, apparently there's a new figure up here. All right. Uh, where would the. Didn't I or wait, is the guy already talked with? No, not. Oh, you sell, oh, you sell hearts. Ooh, nice. However, I guess I won't be talking to you. 
Uh, what did you want to talk about? You were an outlander, no? An adventurer. I used to be one myself. I admit, I miss the beguiling colors of the wilds. Speaking of which, I wonder if you've come across a very special kind of flower. It's made of metal, like a machine. Other blossoms grow around them in amazing patterns. These gleaming beauties are very much in demand among my clients. If you bring me some, I have valuables to trade for them. What about you? You said you were an adventurer. Just so. The nobles of Meridian crave flowers for their balconies and gardens. So out I went, with bow and spear. I made my name by searching the wilds for the wildest blossoms. No bandit nor machine could keep me from those precious petals. So what happened? Love happened, my sweet. My paramour frets too much when I venture out. So now I collect flowers for those without such bonds. Is it worth it? Being restrained like that? Of course. Freedom is sweet. But the embrace of my beautiful Theradine is sweeter still. Anyways, metal flowers? These we have a lot flowers. of those. What are they exactly? No one knows. But some say they began sprouting 20 years ago when the machines started to go mad. Perhaps they grow from the tears of the sun, for he has many faces, does he not? Wrathful one day, cool and patient the next? Perhaps he weeps for our suffering when his anger breaks. Anyways, all right, let's trade. Ah, let us haggle over this beautiful bounty. <clears throat> I'm just going to grab all of those. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Till we meet again, my noble Nora. Could you spare a moment to speak of the finer things? You know, hey, you own all the maps three times now? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean. Were they really all the same maps? Were, were they really all the same maps? <laughs> well, hey, anybody need a map? <laughs> Here you go. Wait, no, I'm trying to collect the map so nobody else can get these flowers. No one else has these flowers. Anyways. <laughs> Clever indeed. <laughs> Mystery box. Oh wait, I think I already yeah, I already messed with you. I don't need to mess with you. I'm on How about you? Let's have a chat. No, no not right now. Colorful discussion. Get two spare just in case you lose one or two. <laughs> Knowing me personally, I probably lose at least one of them. Excuse me, sir. All right. What did you want to discuss? You're an outlander, which is good, but a Nora, which might be bad. Do you fear the ruins of the old ones like many in your tribe? No. Although some can be dangerous. Then you may have come across what I seek. In your travels, have you found strange vessels emblazoned with symbols of the old ones? They consist of a hollow cylinder with a crescent handle affixed at both ends. If you bring me these vessels in sets of four, I will gladly trade what I have for them. So you're interested in the old ones? More than interested. I study every ancient artifact I can get my hands on. But years of study have made me too comfortable at my desk. I can't even bear the sun if the truth be known. I don't and know you how live in the desert. to take a partner. My family presses me for an heir. Uh, don't look at me. 
<laughs> oh, no, 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 I'm, I'm not looking. In fact, my father already has someone he wants me to wed. She doesn't interest me. I wish I had a brother to carry this burden. I would rather be left to my precious little vessels. Huh? <laughs> kind of sounds like me. Except no one has a... Yeah. Wait, no. Hold on. No, that's not me. What sort of ritual were these vessels made for? I'm convinced they were used in conjunction sort of first, with each other actually. in sets. Some people sort of. believe they were used for tea ceremonies. Others think they held sacred essences and oils for worship. But I believe He's they talking were used about for the cuts. solemn custom of shaving one's beard. One for water, one for lotion, and so on. Each fluid in its special vessel majestically applied to the face at each stage of the rite. It must have been breathtaking. <laughs> but which vessel was used for which? I, I don't have know, to Ray. know. I have to it's continue my research. I mean, you it's sure probably where oh, yeah. we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll need Drink? to get into the trading. Out of such finely crafted earthenware? Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> yes, yes. Trade quickly. I have work to do. <laughs> I should have even looked at the own part. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well. <sighs> oh my god, even I forgot. Oh. I'm so stupid. More maps, more maps, more maps. Eat out for the hell of it. Those are my maps. No one else is going to have them. <sighs> Anyways.